so the internet becomes self-aware, we'd all be f Think about it, the internet literally knows every piece of history recorded by mankind, every scientific discovery we've stumbled upon. It would own us instantly. It would know everything. It would be this all-empowered piece of knowledge. And technically, that would make the Earth its body, the internet its brain, the solar system its living room. And we'd just be these little irrelevant parasites living on it. It would become the supreme being and we would cease to be important if we even are. And what about if human beings finally officially met an alien species, an alien race? When we discovered America in 1492, we wiped out most of the indigenous population, the Native Americans, on purpose and by mistake. Between the 16th and 19th century, a lot of countries were involved in the slave trade, which is the enslavement of one human being by another. This was primarily the enslavement of West Africans, and this was done purely for financial gain and quality of life for the enslaver, for the purchaser of that person. And now we have oil wars, where wars are happening, people are dying, purely to gain land that oil is under. Financial gain again. So we do that to our own. Imagine if we met aliens. We wouldn't give a shit. And I don't mean you and me, I mean the powers that control us. No, that's a bit too conspiracy. Because we'd either see them as a benefit and enslave them, or they'd have something we want and we'd take it, or we'd see them as some kind of technological threat to our way of life, and we'd go to war with them. And what if the afterlife really exists? You get all these stories of ghosts and spooks. I've, I've never seen one, don't want to see one. It just scares the bejeebus out of me. But what I don't get is, if ghosts exist, then the afterlife must exist. Not sure if either exists, not sure. But is the afterlife that boring that you have to come back and haunt us? You have to come back and pester us? Why can't you just go and be dead? Living is exhausting. Be dead. Do that. Whatever's over there, go and do that. I don't want the scary ghost lady from Ghostbusters to sit on in my bed screaming at me. That's it. Ran over. I apologise. I'll be quiet now. That goddamn lad. Goddamn hate you lad.